Did you poison your boyfriend? Poison? Boyfriend? I don't think you know what the rich have to do to stay rich, Talia. Your father's actually a saint in comparison. What did you wish for when you threw that rock? Come on. Come on, Mary. Tell me, what is it you want? What do you want, Mary? You want the moon? Yeah, just, just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around it and I'll pull it down. Yeah, that's not bad. I'll get you the moon. Well, then you could swallow it and it all dissolve, see? And then the moonbeams would shoot out your fingertips and your toes and the ends of your hair and... Am I talking too much? Can you please stop doing that? Could you stop doing that? My pleasure. I'll go grab that to-go cup for you from the back. Oh, look at you two little seeds of romance blossoming in the savanna. Your parents will be thrilled. What with your big betrothed and all? <laughs> betrothed? Intended. Affianced. One day, you two will be married. Oh, well, sorry to bust your bubble, but you two turtle doves have no choice. It's a tradition going back generations. You don't have to, Beth. Forget about my mother's house. You wouldn't even spend the night in my own fucking apartment. It's the best I can do. And I clean it and clean it and clean it. And you still make me go over to your place. And it's not because you have to get up early because you don't have to get up that early. Because you're a fucking artist at the school, for fuck's sake. I mean, what is that? But you won't let me go. You have to have me around. And I keep wondering why. Because I know it's not because you love me. It's not because I make your whole world, or I'm your whole life, or any of that crap. Because you hate who I really am. My whole past, my whole life. That stuff you're so proud of, that's me pretending to be somebody else. Because everything else about me makes you want to puke. Is that what you like when I'm not here? Like, I'm a fucking pig. Like, I'm a fucking piece of slime, and if you're not here to keep me in line, I'll just sink in my own shit. The shit that I come from, the shit that's my life, the shit that's me. Like, you're not shit. You sit there, and you condescend to me like I'm a fucking idiot who can't tie his own shoes. That's why you keep me around. Because you can't feel good about yourself unless there's somebody else in the room for you to look down on. Come back soon. Bitch.